Hey, what's up everyone? Josh here, and today instead of holding a guitar, I'm holding my favorite coffee mug. I've got my Geralt of Rivia Fallout crossover shirt going on. I mean, it's getting real nerdy in here, y'all. Hope you know how much I trust y'all letting you see this side of me, okay? This nerd side. But anyway, just want to come on here and chill, hang out with you guys, provide a few updates, and reflect on the musical journey that's been over the last month or so. It's been really awesome. Hope you dig the new setup. This is a little bit new. It used to be the camera face this wall. You can see all the crap on there, but you know, I wanted to make it more modern and cool. You know, it's 2024, man. You gotta have the cool lights and all that stuff. And being a lefty, you can see me play a little bit better this way. And I wanted to be able to showcase some of the art that I've got going on here. My good friend, Nicole, if you know, you know, she does incredible stuff. We've got the gals here and then we have the uh, jellyfish dance party, that's what I call it, back there. And hopefully we can get a link to her stuff soon so we can start posting her stuff in my videos as well. So I'm calling you out, Nicole, let's go, let's do it. Anyway, before we move on, I wanted to really thank everyone from the bottom of my little heart that has dropped a like, a comment, followed the YouTube page, followed the Facebook page. All of that stuff means more to me than I could ever express in this little video. You know, if you've known me, you know that music is my passion. It's what makes me the happiest in life. It really does. And being able to have a platform like YouTube and have support from y'all like I do is truly, truly a dream come true for me. So I just wanted to say that, how much it means to me and how much I appreciate the hell out of it. And trust me, folks, commit to your damn vision. You can do it. So anyway, that's all the sappy crap out of the way. Let's move on to the, the business. You know, the blockbuster news headlines from the old Hambone Studios here. So first of all, you may have noticed over the years that I've released stuff under the name A Dream Deferred. And that has been a band name that I've always wanted like since high school. The, <laughs> I shouldn't even tell you this, but where I got that name was from The Legend of Zelda, Link's Awakening on the Game Boy. That's how old I am whatever. And I was like, whoa, that's cool. But the problem is it's just me, Josh Hammond. And then you have a dream deferred and people are like, wait, is that him? Is that the, and I get it. And some folks have said, it's a little tough to remember that name. Cause I tell them at Safeway or something. I'm like, yeah, it's under a dream deferred on Spotify. I'm like, okay. And then they go home and they're like, what do you say? A dreamy oh. Herford? What was that? And then you search that and you get some weird stuff. But anyway, I wanted to make it easier for that to be tied to the YouTube channel, the Facebook page and all that stuff. So search for Josh Hammond project on your platforms and you should still get all the stuff I've released. Everything is still transitioning over a little bit. It takes a little bit of time, but segueing into, I have a new song out called where dreams are under the Josh Hammond project title or umbrella, if you will. This is nothing new. It's a part of you. Feelings are constricted. Conversation scripted. You cannot ease your mind. Because it's been and this song is really important to me. It's about neurodivergent experiences and really learning to embrace them. And it's written from three different perspectives: the creator, the self, and they, which is, you know, other people. And I wrote the song from personal experience and also experience that I've heard and seen with other folks in my life. So it's very important to me, very personal, but it's also using an AI singer, which is really my first go at writing a song for vocals. And that challenges your songwriting. It challenges your mixing when you're making it sound how it's supposed to challenges all that stuff. I also have another song coming out probably in May sometime, I think. It's a little more pop punky, it's a little more rocky. It's called Nice to Meet Me and that one's using a female AI vocalist. So be on the lookout for some videos related to that. as we continue. And speaking of new music, my friends over in the band River, that's RVR, they just released on April 10th their single and it's super awesome. So if you know 
Aaron Moore, him and I have been friends forever. We're both 100 years old and we've, you know, been through many battles together in the music world. But he has really done an awesome job with the singer JC in creating this pop punk mixed with a little bit of metalcore type stuff. And the song is catchy as hell. So congratulations to you guys. Just wanted to throw that in here while I was thinking of it because I'm scrolling on Facebook and I saw the post. So there's that. Anyway, more videos will be on the way soon. We'll have more guitar stuff, all that fun jazz. Let me know what y'all are up to this weekend. Here in Montana, I don't know what we're up to this weekend because we don't know what the weather's gonna do. It's always just right? But for my friends in the more stable areas where the weather is getting better, let me know what you're up to, man. What's the plan this weekend? What are we doing? Hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day. Thank you again for all the support musically. I'd love to do more videos like this, just chilling with you, hanging out, and uh, yeah. I'm running out of things to say. I gotta work on my outros, I guess. But anyway, it's, it's the end of the video. I don't know. <laughs> all right, get out of here.